What's up guys, welcome back to yet another video. Finally, we were managed to install Android 12 Beta 4 on our OnePlus 5. So here you can see this is my OnePlus 5 on which we have installed the Android 12 Beta 4 GSI image. And almost everything is working fine. And Android 12 Beta 4 can be used as daily driver on your OnePlus 5 or 5T. First, let me show you the software information. On our OnePlus 5, we have used Pixel 5 GSI image. And the Android version, you can see Android version is Android 12 and Beta 4 had the 5th August 2021 security patch. Also guys, if you want to install Android 12 Beta 4 on your OnePlus 5 and 5T, all the necessary files can be found in the description below and at the end of video, you can also find the installation guide. None of the GSI comes with pre-installed Google camera application. You need to manually install the APK. Link of that can also be found in the description below. Geo SIM card, I was unable to make calls, but after changing the SIM card, right now I'm using my Airtel SIM card and I don't have any kind of issues related to calling. None of the sensors have any kind of issues like accelerometer, light, proximity, magnetometer, compass and gyroscope. OnePlus 5 will have these gestures and hardware keys working at the same time. There's no option to disable the hardware keys on a OnePlus 5. I personally don't have any kind of issues using the gestures along with the hardware keys. If I want to have the taste of Android 12, I'm okay with these two functions working at the same time. And I'm also happy that my OnePlus 5 is able to run Android 12 pretty smooth. Till now, no lags or jitters to be seen while using this Android 12 GSI. Now let's quickly take a look at some of the new features added on Android 12 Beta 4. And one of them can be found in the wallpaper and style section, which is related to this theme icon. And here they have done a minor change. In front of theme icon, they have just added this beta tag. So if you guys aren't aware about themed icon, this is a feature if you enable it, icons on the home screen will adapt to the color scheme of the device, which completely depends on your wallpaper you have applied. Along with that, you'll also see some minor changes done in the icons on Google search bar. That also adapts to the same color scheme. With Beta 4, Google have added this network indicator in the status bar, which was missing on the previous builds. Along with the network indicator, they have also added the Wi-Fi toggle, which wasn't seen on previous builds. Now let's go inside the settings. Here under network and internet, no issues to be seen with the Wi-Fi bands. Both the bands are working fine 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz. Under display, adaptive brightness is fully functional. Also no issues to be seen with always on display. Gestures like double tap to wake works fine. Also features like one handed mode doesn't have any kind of issues. And one of my favorite feature in Android 12 is this new game dashboard, which comes with few most needed features for gamers like FPS meter. Do not disturb mode can be activated from here. We have the screen recording feature with beta 4. Now Google have added the Google play option in the game dashboard directly. And trust me guys, features in this game dashboard are quite handy for mobile gamers. And the best part of Android 12 on my OnePlus 5 is that I have working fingerprint scanner. On most of the devices where we flash GSI images, we don't get fingerprint and few other stuff working. But that's not the case on OnePlus 5. Your fingerprint unlock works fine with no delay at all. So guys, this was a quick look on Android 12 Beta 4 for OnePlus 5 and 5T. Now let's move on to the installation guide. Before installing Android 12 Beta 4, make sure your device is running the latest build of Oxygen OS. The latest build of Oxygen OS is based on Android 10, which is Oxygen OS 10.0.1. As said, make sure you have flashed the latest build of Oxygen OS on your OnePlus 5 or 5T. After that, we need CR Droid Room, which is based on Android 11, Orange Fox Recovery, Pixel 5 GSI image, which is based on Beta 4, No Verity, and a patch file. So the patch file can be found inside the main GSI image. So GSI image is in zip format. You just need to right click and extract the file. Once you extract, you'll have these three files inside. On our OnePlus 5 and 5T, we only need these two files. So these are the files which are required to be flashed on your OnePlus 5 or 5T. So let's copy them one by one. One is CR Droid, Orange Fox Recovery, if you have already flashed, then it is not required. Patch file, which we got it from GSI. Then this system file also, this is an image file. This also we extracted from GSI image and at last no variety. So these are the required files. You can copy them all and paste it inside the internal storage of your device. After you have copied the files, boot your device into Orange Fox Recovery. If you guys aren't aware about booting your device or installing custom recovery, then I'll leave a video guide in the description below. Just follow that video guide and you'll be able to install custom recovery on your OnePlus 5 or 5T. 
So here you can see we have the files. One is the custom room. Second one is the patch file, system image file and no variety. So first what we'll do is we'll flash CR droid room, which is a custom room. Selecting it, swipe to install. And this might take around three to four minutes. Once you have successfully flashed the CR droid room, go to wipe section and from here select wipe dalvik slash ART caches, caches, system and data. Guys, do not select vendor here because we are using vendor from CR droid. Swipe to wipe. And once this is done successfully, go back, go to the main installation directory. And from here, now we'll flash the system image. So this is an Android 12 image. Tapping on it from here, you need to select system image and swipe to install image. Installation will hardly take 10 to 15 seconds. Once that's done, we'll again go back and now we'll flash this patch file. Selecting it, swipe to install. After this file is flashed successfully, we'll again go back. And now last file which we are going to flash is this, no variety. We'll select this, swipe to install. And there we go. We have completed the installation process of Android 12 Beta 4. Now you need to go back, go to wipe section, select format data and type VS. Hit this tick mark. Once done, just reboot your system. And as you can see here, now our device will boot into Android 12. And here we are into Android 12. So guys, this way you can install Android 12 Beta 4 on your OnePlus 5 and 5T. If you still have any kind of questions, let me know in the comment section below. This is your friend Ashok signing out. See you guys in the next video.